This is a tip I've been using myself for a while, but I still believe a lot of people don't know about it. So on your MacBooks, it has a built-in stream recording option. Make sure you have your USB microphone already plugged in, because if you try to plug it in afterwards, what's going to happen is you won't be able to see the option to select your USB mic. So I'm all plugged in, so I'm good to go. Press and hold the command button, press and hold shift, and you just got to tap the number five. You don't have to press and hold it. And you'll bring up these options here. So if you're unfamiliar with these options, these to the side here are for like just pictures. And these to the right here are for recording videos. So when you have your options selected, what you'll have to do is press the options button and you'll see all of the audio options here to the side. So you should see your USB mic option right here. So go ahead and select that and just start recording. The only thing that you have to keep in mind is you can't really adjust the volume. So whenever you, if you're using like a video editing program, you have to increase the volume or lower the volume, but you can always just, you know, control the gain. If your microphone has a gain option built in, so my microphone has like a knob where I can control the gain. So I try to keep the gain kind of low because I don't mind, you know, raising the volume in my editing program. If you're interested in other ways to stream record, like using the actual audio, like say if you're watching a movie or something like that and you want the actual audio from the movie, from the laptop, I have different videos on how to do stuff like that. So I'm gonna leave, I think, I think I got two videos when it comes to different ways to record audio and, and, and video stream record. So I'll leave those in the video description down below for you. But for this video, that's all I got for you. Much love to each and every one of you. I'm your downloading pirate, and I'm out.